All right, so I um, apologize. The first one of these actually got deleted, so I have to do this again. But let's start. Um, got a new shelf and decided to move some cells around, give myself a little more room, get rid of some stuff, and put some more stuff on the new shelf, um, which you will see later. But this is the shelf that I kind of moved around, moved stuff around, and uh, hopefully you guys like this. Uh, decided to do this rather than a full-blown room tour. So, uh, here I have uh, my Aquaman uh, shelf, um, classic, uh, you know, comic Aquaman, Jason Momoa Aquaman, and then another Jason Momoa Aquaman. Um, the bucket and the cup my wife got, um, we absolutely love this movie. It is by far my favorite um, DC movie, yes, I put it over the Batman, but I still, I it, that's just me. I, I think the Batman was very, very good, but Aquaman, I absolutely loved it. I can't wait for the second one. I'm sick of this bull crap that is currently um, stalling it, you know, from coming out. I'm just sick of it. I want to see it. Let's do this. So let's make it happen. And then over here, we have my It collection and It Chapter 2. We have Pennywise. Uh, Pennywise and Jack in the Box, um, Tim Curry's Pennywise, and the Losers Club, the Cup Topper, I Love Dairy, and that tin actually came with the um, Jack in the Box Pennywise. So I'll go over one more. Um, these are all comedy v or DVDs. Uh, Kevin Smith, uh, Jeff Dunham. Uh, Bill Ingvall, Gabriel Iglesias. Uh, I don't know why I decided to put them with the Mighty Ducks, but I did, and it works. You know, I'm happy with it. So, um, you know, let's move on to the next shelf. So, I have um, my anime shelf. Uh, I have, uh, well, one of my anime shelves. I have all the animated uh, TV shows and movies in the back. I have Goku, Super Saiyan Goku, I have Astro Boy, McDonald's, I believe, or Burger King, I can't remember, uh, Super Saiyan 5, Gogeta, uh, or maybe that's 4, you know what, I want to say it's Super Saiyan 4, that's my bad, um, you have the uh, Pumpkin King from Yu-Gi-Oh, and then you just have this little candy tin, which is a Dragon Ball. Uh, so, second uh, anime shelf, I have Gundams, um, Gundam Universe, Heavy Arms, Strike Rogue, and Unicorn. Um, M, I've heard they're going to be doing a Heavy Arms from the Endless Waltz series. So if I can get my hands on that, I will open up that Heavy Arms uh, normal one and replace it with the uh, the Heavy Arms uh, Endless Waltz as the unopened one. So. Got another shelf over here, which is Street Sharks and Toxic Crusader. Um, I absolutely love Toxic Crusader. I've been wanting that figure for a while. I had it when I was a kid. Unfortunately, I don't remember what happened to it. Most likely, I traded it like I do with all things. And then my Street Sharks, although looking a little beat up, the collection is growing. Um, this guy is brand new. I just got him, I want to say, last month. So, really happy to add him to the collection. Come down, Smallville. Um, this, all these shelves used to be my TV shows. Um, and, you know, this was the only, uh, one of the two that I couldn't get on my new shelf. So, I decided to put it here. Uh, there's just so many of these, these box sets and seasons. So, I had to put them here. Um, I have the Batman uh, lunch pail. I actually got that at a Goodwill and or Goodwill bins. And then this guy I um, got in like a grab bag. But he is, I believe, Nick Nitro from uh, Small Soldiers. So really happy to get him. His drill bit, um, you know, moves if you push push down the toaster. So got a Jeffrey the Giraffe uh, kids pulling toy. Um, uh, Jeffrey's World, it was a uh, Toys R Us exclusive um, kids pulling toy. So really happy to get that. I got that for 10 bucks at a Goodwill. I still can't believe I found that. That was freaking amazing. 
So this little robot here, he spins, he makes noise, and he, um, you know, lights up and all that stuff. The only thing that he's missing is his blasters. Uh, those would have been cool to get, but, you know, I think he was only like a dollar, so I'm not going to complain. So I have uh, my Scooby-Doo collection and Ren and Stimpy. Um, my other cartoon collection, I have, um, Powerpuff Girls, G.I. Joes, Mario, Donkey Kong, and Garbage Pail Kids. Um, I do have more. I do have a few more Marios. Um, and I think one more. Uh, so I will be putting that in there. Um, I just gotta, you know, catalog them, so. Got over here, movies, big box sets, so, VHS. VHS and VHS that uh, Mummy's Alive is actually a promo. Uh, I got that one. So I believe that was only like 50 cents. Uh, uh, popcorn bucket for Head of Training Dragon, the last one. Captain Marvel and Force Awakens. Now, this thing right here, this little uh, CD case, it actually has the entire series of MASH in there. Um, unfortunately, the case or the um, the packaging that the, that Sears came in was crap, absolute crap, and it just didn't work. So uh, my dad put those in there, and then he gave them to me later on. Um, a lot of them are scratched and all that. I do need to get all of them cleaned up and put back in order uh, because we have watched them over and over and over and over again. So. Well, give me a minute. We'll move over to my new shelf and show you that one. All right. So here's my new shelf. Um, I'll give you a quick pan over. Um, it's just a multimedia shelf. I actually got this. Um, it's on a, uh, a curb while I was working. Um, I asked the lady. She goes, yeah, it's, it's trash. You can have it. So I was like, awesome. Thank you. So, but I put uh, my Doctor Who stuff, including my lunchbox, the seasons, with all four doctors in it. Uh, I do not have any of the, the lady ones. Um, I have the Doctor Who uh, uh, Lego set, Leonard, a few other the shows, and just a lot of TV shows. Um, really good stuff. I enjoy it. So... But yeah, that is my new shelf. Alright, so I've also been doing something else. I've putting, been putting uh, video game and other stuff in front of my movies. Just to display them. So, I have a buck from ODSTs. I got Sar uh, Sergeant Johnson with Guilty Sparks. And Cortana from all, four, all three from Halo. I have a... Um, Atari uh, plug and play, Pac Man plug and play, a Tiger Electronics Lights Out. Uh, got that at a. Got that and the Oregon Trail and the Dr. Robotnik for like 10 cents each, or maybe a dollar each um, at the Goodwill Benz. Uh, very nice condition. This one is probably my favorite. I love playing this thing, it does work. It does play well. Uh, this one also works. Uh, I still haven't figured out how to play it. I need to watch a little video on it. And this thing, if you take a Sonic and you hit it right there with a catapult, the whole thing falls apart. His arms pop off, his legs pop off, and he goes down for the count. That was the game. So, really cool. I also got uh, this Duke Nukem Forever hat. Um, yeah, I got that at uh, Goodwill Bins. And the Mario uh, stress ball or plastic ball. I got that at the bins. And then Charmander. Also got him at the bins. So, got a cabbage uh, or no garbage pail kid. Um, I got him from the bins as well. And this guy from the bins. Um, he is a creepy crawly crawling figure. I didn't know they had these things. But they are super cool. And I am glad to have him. Now, if you hold on, I will move us to one more shelf, and then I can bid you adieu. 
All right, so this is uh, more of my movie shelves. I have my multi-pass with some Yu-Gi-Oh cards behind it. Uh, this was the Luke's Crate exclusive uh, McDonald's Rufio uh, toy. He-Man um, Dollar Tree figures, or Dollar and a Quarter Tree figures now. Um, McDonald's Stopwatch. Yeah, I don't know what year this is. Um... Uh, looks like 1991 so very cool um, I love the colors and all that pinky in the brain uh, you have pinky on the ball brain brain on the crane and then you come down here I have a, a loot crate um, half scale endoskeleton or endo skull from salvation <coughs> sorry about that not feeling really well. Um, I have the cups from Ready Player One and Zombie Double Tap. Um, both pretty decent movies. I have a uh, lights, camera, action board game. Still haven't played it. And Josh Whedon and that guy uh, figure they came with a, another movie about Comic Con. Down here I have a Batman lunchbox. Three cups of um, Han Solo and my 3D scary movie M&M's. So that is it, guys. That is all. Hopefully you enjoyed this. Hopefully you'll uh, hit that like button. Um, if you want to see more of these videos, please check out what I have. I have a lot more uh, collection. I tried to do videos. I'm not very good at uh, the old ones anymore. And I don't like being on camera, so because let's face it, I, I ugly. So uh, I know a lot of people probably go, "Oh no, no, you're you're fine," and it's, you know, you're delusional. So, but thank you anyway, guys. Um, like I said, hit that like and subscribe button, and hopefully I can put out some more videos. You guys have a good day and enjoy the rest of it. Bye.